But what a scene, what a setting, as we all come together at this beautiful Grace River Island Resort on this beautiful Thursday afternoon to celebrate this couple and their wonderful marriage. Kelly, you have taught me that two people join together with respect, trust, and open communication can be far stronger and happier than each could be ever be alone. You are the strength I didn't know I needed and the joy that I didn't know I lacked. You are everything that I ever dreamed of and everything I'll ever need. With this ring, I promise to be here with you and for you forever and always. Michael, I have dreamed of this day my entire life and have waited decades to find you. You are my best friend and my partner in this crazy little life we have. You are the most thoughtful and romantic person I know. You make me laugh, you support me, and never let me forget how beautiful and amazing you think I am. You've helped me blossom into the mother that I am today and have shown me a love that is pure, magical, and everlasting. You are the love of my life and I'm inter internally grateful for you. I promise to be faithful and supportive and always make our family's love and happiness my priority. I promise to love and hold you and cherish you for all of the days of my life. I give you my hand and my heart. You are my person today and always. With my whole heart, I take you as my husband. an older sister was like having a second mom, but better, because I could borrow her clothes, jewelry, and she let me all, and let me do all the things our mom wouldn't let me do. Mike, I've known Kelly for a long time and could not have picked a better husband for her. And, and new friend for me. I'm proud to call you a true friend and hope if you ever need any advice, right, <laughs> call me and make your own judgment. Today we celebrate the union of so much more than just your hearts. Kelly and Mike, you have already created a beautiful life together with two healthy, handsome boys. But after today, you will start your life together as Mr. and Mrs. George. Everyone, please raise your glasses and toast to Kelly and Mike. Now, their story is quite unique. Up in Michigan, we have all these wonderful lakes. These two met as teenagers. As the story goes, Kelly was sitting on the dock and Mike was ripping through the water on his jet ski with his friends. I'm not exactly so sure of the showmanship, but there was a specific image that both of them have when they met as teenagers. Life can be very interesting. And although they lived in a very close town and they would run by each other every so often, their paths at that point went in different directions. But 25 years later, they had an opportunity to reunite. It all started at a lake party. Prior to that day, Kelly had dinner with one of her close friends from middle school and high school. Where's Jamie at? There's Jamie. Jamie informed Kelly at that dinner that Michael George would be there and that he was still single. Their mutual friend, Dee, was having a lake party on a Saturday summer evening. So after dinner, Kelly got, her, got involved in her what I would call detective work. She went on to social media 
She immediately looked up Michael. She requested him to be friends. Kelly realized that Mike wasn't a big user of social media. So Kelly figured that if they were gonna unite on this party on Saturday evening, it might get back to just good old fashioned communication. So on Saturday, this summer evening, which was August 13th, 2016, Kelly and Mike had an opportunity to reunite for the first time in a long time. That greeting led into a beautiful sunrise the next morning before they arrived back to the port. Several weeks later, they had their first date at the Black Rock Bar and Grill in Heartland, Michigan that I mentioned earlier. Kelly will say it, the rest is history. I'm thinking the journey is just getting started. It is my distinct honor to be able for the very first time to introduce you, Mr. and Mrs. Michael George. Congratulations. Bless her time again.